Clint Cosgrove rivals national recruiting analyst here with uh, maybe one of the biggest commitments of the year, the nation's number one receiver, five-star Carnell Tate out of IMG Academy, originally from Chicago, though, still represents Chicago. He's in Chicago right now. But uh, we've got Ohio State's newest commit. Man, Carnell, how does it feel to be a Buckeye? Oh, it feels great being a to- uh, being a Buckeye now, you finally get to work with Coach Arline and stuff like that, and uh, not play the recruiting game anymore. Like that's all about ball, and he's all about developing his players and his re- receivers. So we're just focusing on ball and, and helping me uh, get developed and get ready to play there. Nah, man. I mean, uh, I I know what you've been through. I mean, you have you've had to change your phone number. You've had coaches hit you up. The media. I mean, it's nonstop. Yeah. You know. Uh, it's got to, I mean, this will be a big relief to you. And, 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 you know, I know you're excited about where you're going. I mean, but you could have gone anywhere, Carnell. Like, I know your top five was Georgia, Ohio State, Alabama, Notre Dame, and Tennessee. But at the end of the day, you know, why Ohio State? You know, what what made them stand out above the rest? Oh, uh, I, I love Coach Arlon and what, what he has done at the uh, for the wide opposition. And like you could see, it, like we all saw from his previous year when he had Christian Garrett, and he had made them. Uh, they went on to be first round picks. And then you also have uh, Ryan Day in his offense, who's calling the plays and stuff like that. His offense is designed designed for receivers to eat, and all you need is a quarterback to get you the ball, which I know they're capable of finding a quarterback each and every year to get me the ball. But it really came down to development and stuff like that, and the rich history with receivers, like they have Michael Thomas, Antonio Holmes. Like they are Paris Campbell, Terry McLaurin, great receivers that came before me and stuff like that. And I, I just hope to be on the uh, path to be the next great receiver to come come out of Ohio State. Yeah, man, I'm telling you, like, they even from my days growing up, when my dad was the defensive coordinator at Wisconsin, I remember Terry Glenn and, like, all these old school dudes that some of you, you young bucks might not know about. But, I mean, they were straight ballers, man. Yeah. And uh, I know you, you have a dynamic skill set where, yeah, you can stretch the field and you got the size, but I mean, you can play in the slot, you can line up anywhere. So uh, it sounds like a pretty good fit. Uh, as as uh, the newest Buckeye commit, you know, what are your what are your next plans, Carnell? I know you want to have a big senior year at IMG, um, but what are you looking to do next? I'm just I'm just looking to develop my uh, craft, honestly, like. It's- Get, get become a better receiver and better man and on and off the field. Now I don't have to worry about the recruiting game anymore. It's, it's all over and done. So I'll be up there at, the, at Ohio State uh, sometime soon just to go up there and camp and work with Coach Harlan and have fun with the guys and then also reconnect with my boy KB. Oh, yeah, you and Caleb back together, man. Oh, yeah. oh my God. I forget. I, I feel like you guys were in the same class, but I guess he was one year before you. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's great, man. I love Caleb, too. Um, Well, uh, I don't want to take up too much of your time, but I'm extremely excited for you. Let's finish with this uh, because the Buckeye fans, man, I mean, like your recruitment was one of the (laughs) like I've never seen anything followed like it before. Fanatical fans, everything. But like the Buckeye fans are going to be so fired up when they find out that you committed to them. What is your message to the Ohio State fans, Carnell? Well, I'm ready to be ball. I'm ready to be a ball player and be the next great receiver to come out of Ohio State and, and uh, put my name in the history books. Well, I have no question that you'll do it. Um, you know, I, I knew you'd be special from a young age. First video interview I ever did was with you. And the first video interview that you ever did with me. Oh, yeah. And my wife, my wife is like, oh, my God, I remember him when he was young and, oh, yeah. and all that, man. So it's, it yep. is – uh. It's just it's been special to follow you and and see how things have ended up. But I wish you the best. Can't wait uh, to watch you next year. Thank and you. then obviously beyond at Ohio State, I know you're going to do big things, man. But thank you for your time and thank congratulations. You. Thank you. We got Ohio State's newest commit, Carnell Tate, number one receiver in the entire nation.